Good afternoon, YouTubers. This is Mr. Windbreaker. Today, this is my first audio recording, so I do apologise, it's not scripted, and uh, I'll probably be repeating myself, but I'll try to speak at a reasonable speed so at least you can hear me. Um, today, I'm going to be hopefully flying for the first time in ATI mode. That's without the aid of the GPS compass or the obstacle avoidance system. Um, I'm also recording the screen on my on my DJI remote as well as recording some footage using my uh, drone, my DJI Spark drone. So let's get to it. Right. So in the moment I'm in GPS and I'm going to start the um, the props rotating. Okay. So not not quite yet. Okay. Even though um, authorization detected in geo for the flight and is restricted when approaching the no-fly zone during a flight. This is one thing I don't like about this, um, the modified Go4 app, is that because it's not updated, um, I'm finding I'm getting these restrictions. But the reason why I'm using the Go4 mod app is because you are unable to um, switch off recording to quiche with the video quiche memory on your phone and that's the only drawback of the authorised DJI 4 app otherwise that's the reason why I'm using this one but right hello YouTubers okay it looks like by admitting a fault I may have bypassed the uh, flight restriction however I'm going to see by activating the props again in GPS no, we've still got it we still have it uh, Okay, right, just bear with me once again, YouTube. I, 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 okay, I'm, so uh, what I found out is using the uh, the DJI 4 modified app, it, it would not, no matter how I tried, allow me fly in a restricted zone. However, the restriction is Britannia Stadium, and the Britannia Stadium is literally about three or four miles away, so I'm probably just on the outskirts of the restriction zone. Anyway, I couldn't use that app. I wanted to use the modified version because I can actually turn off uh, quiche recording which you cannot turn off in the um, the official DJI app so now I'm using the D the official DJI app in order to actually uh, record some footage and fly so okay so I'm in GPS mode okay take off okay so I'm also going to be recording so this is the this is the problem I'm having I'm hoping to record the screen, phone screen, whilst take audio and record at the same time. I'm also using the FCC mod and I'm aware of the um, legal restrictions with, with regards to using that mod but like myself and other DJI drone users we receive a more reliable video signal which in turn ensures a safer flight. Now I do not fly beyond 250 meters and I never fly above the 400 feet height mark um, and I know there are those videos on YouTube at the moment showing extreme heights and extreme distances however I wouldn't thought those would be applicable with the Spark or any drone to fly illegally because as you know we're currently getting a lot of bad press uh, at the moment and quite frankly it's no wonder we, we, we're already restricted that's why I have to resort to the FCT acts especially with the Swart because the Video output isn't that strong, but over 300 meters, I can get excellent footage, and the, um, the the transmission to my phone hardly ever breaks up, which ensures a safer flight. So as you can see, I'm in GPS flight mode now. Okay, I'm on my second battery now, and um, now we're going to try again. Uh, I've got the FCC mod which as long as you press cancel all the t uh, every time you receive notification you should be absolutely fine by confirming that you will see the channels now if you've just got the 11 low channels uh, low range 2.4 gig channels instead of you're in full transmission mode if you are not in FCC that would be CA which is the UK equivalent to the America uh, you would see uh, 1 to 13 so we've that in mind, I know. Well, yes, it's okay. I've got a good reception. 
all ready to go. I'm in GPS mode. Ah, that's one thing I've noticed. It's still in small sports mode, but it's gone straight to GPS. So if I put it into sports mode, okay. Right, I'll do. I'll take off in in uh, GPS mode. Um, take off. Okay, GPS mode. I'm the home point it. has been updated. Please point check it on the map. Off. Okay, which is also good. I'm going to switch over, switch over to sports mode. The sports mode is not sports mode. It's uh, the Atti mode. Now, how I've, how I've configured that. There we go. We're in Atti. So no, no position. And as you can see, the quadcopter's dripping up, drifting, dripping off again, drifting again. It's essential to learn for when you do be, come across the situations where you lose GPS. Now then, like I said, um, how I got permanent Atti on the uh, switch on the front of the remote DJI remote, the DJI, the older version of this uh, DJI assistant, and access the parameters. Obviously, I'm not going to go into exact detail. I'll review the footage and see what speed I'm doing, but I'm nowhere near full throttle. And quite frankly, like I say, I wouldn't, I wouldn't want to be. Okay. The only thing is you don't get no front strobe lights, well, when you're recording, so therefore you need a good bright day to fly it. I'd rather have Atti mode, like I've said previously, there we go, for fair, low and fast shots without, with 100% control. I mean, prior to my first flight today, because I've been um, making alterations with the parameters, I have... Um, Done a compass cal calibration, and and also the uh, the uh, you got the IMU calibration, I believe that's also been done. But yeah, it's you see when when you go forward, if you let go, the the quadcopter just keeps on flying forward until you give um, a negative input. If anyone's interested, just drop me a line. I'll gladly go through with you. Um, how to change the flight modes, but I'm, I mustn't. I must stress enough that changing the flight modes, you more than likely void your warranty. But if you're a safe pilot and don't take extreme risks, then you should be okay with that. But nonetheless, you would still probably invalidate your warranty. Mr. Windbreaker signing out for now, and um, if you like, subscribe. Then you'll be the fourth, <laughs> and give me a thumbs up.